Hi, and welcome to another Market Minute. Today we're gonna to talk about how buyers find the home that they chose to purchase. Every year, the National Association of Realtors puts out an over 100 page document of that year. They compile all the data for that year. And this one we're gonna talk about is how the buyers found their home. So let's start with open houses. If you were to guess how many buyers find their home using or but because they went to an open house, so in other words, they went to the open house and bought the house that they saw, what would you think the percentage would be? Well, it's 6%. And so it's a really ineffective way to buy a home. And the reason I really want you to know this is that we're in the middle of a pandemic and the thought of having strangers in your home might be really uncomfortable. Um, when we do showings, we have more control. We can ask for masks, gloves, booties, hand sanitizer, but in an open house, it's a little different. The people that come through an open house um, are nosy neighbors. They're people looking for decorating ideas. And the people that are just starting their search, usually it's six to 18 months, two years. I've even had four years down the pipe where your home, you're hoping if you're a seller, is not gonna take that long to sell. Age, buyers that are serious hire agents to work with them. And I can assure you that as an agent, none of us wait to an open house to show a buyer that we're working with a property. We schedule a showing. So they're a really ineffective way to sell your home. So the million dollar question you're probably asking is, then why do so many people do them? Well, there's three reasons. The first is it makes sellers happy. If the seller hasn't gotten an offer or not many showings, the agent will say, I'll throw an open house, you know, let's hold an open house. And they go, yay. And it's a tangible thing that you could say you've done. The second reason is that buyers at the early stage of their looking haven't decided on an agent to work with yet. And so it's a prospecting tool for real estate agents to find a buyer. And then the third reason is the marketing, um, the marketing of the open houses. So the brokerage firms like Cole or Banker, Michael Saunders and Company, Sotheby's, whomever, they can do a big spread in the newspaper or, or online and they can say, look at all our listings and look how many are being held open. So it's just really great branding for them. But what's in it for you? I just don't see a lot of benefit for a seller. You have to leave your house on a Sunday in the middle of a pandemic for a 6% chance that you're gonna find the buyer for your home. If it were me, no thank you. So that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed this Market Minute. Have a great Friday and an even better weekend.